Hello, Nomads Kalbt, and yeah, this video is about posing with a mask, and you can use um, multi selection. This is new in version 178 or 177. Okay, so how does it work? So, this is your test object or my test object. So, I want to yeah pose the arm a little bit uh, different so i select the, the arm and i select the cell mask tool and i'm masking here this part of the arm so the next thing is i want to transform the arm with a complete hand and the fingers so I use here the select tool, this one, and I select the whole arm. So at this point I show you how it does not work. So here in the side view you can use now the gizmo and the align function here and you can place your gizmo in a new position here like this. In the el elbow position so all the meshes are selected and when you use now your gizmo only the arm is transformed so why okay because here the the hand and the fingers here they are not validated it works only with validated objects. So let's validate the objects here. So now everything is validated. Okay, I try it again. So I select everything. I use the gizmo, the pivot, and I place the pivot here in the in the elbow position. So let's try it. Okay, everything is selected, everything is validated, but only the arm is transformed. So the next thing is why does it not work? Because here in the settings Perhaps it's a bug or you have to do it manually. You see here the, the vertex option here in this menu. Here it's set on auto. And you have to change this target option. Press vertex. When when auto when the auto fun function is on, normally vertex mode should work. But press vertex if it does not work. So, and now when you move your arm, you can pose the complete arm in the direction you want. So this is nice for posing and you don't have to join the objects together. You can use the multi-selection and it works fine. So. Yeah, I think you get it. Have fun with sculpting. Ciao.